Hello, this is Dan Talion Jones, and I'll be reminding you at the end of this video to press the like button, because you will, and share this with your Facebook friends. I'm going to show you today how to make a subliminal website using WordPress. That means you'll learn how to flash subliminal messages to your visitor as they visit your WordPress site. Now, before we start, and you follow my instructions, I'd like to make a statement to those people who find the use of subliminal messages unethical, offensive, and sneaky. My statement is, quite simply, I don't care. In spite of the rumors, using subliminal messages is not illegal. There is not a single criminal statute in the books that says you can't use subliminal messages. In fact, I dare you to find one. I recommend you read my books to find out how to be really good at influencing other people and at least be able to recognize influence when it's being used on you. Nor do I consider the use of subliminal messages any more unethical than women putting on makeup in order to get what they want or for that matter an advertising agency using a pretty girl to sell a product. Subliminal messages are really nothing more than a means to an end. And if you don't like it, I don't care. So what are you going to need in order to start this? Well, what you'll need first of all is a website that is a WordPress website. You'll also need photo editing software like Adobe Photoshop or you can use Photoscape which is a free software that I'll be using. <coughs> And you'll also need uh, FTP software to upload the various images. Now after you've set up your WordPress site, I'll show you how to make the background images of your website display subliminal messages using the WordPress widget called Site Background Slider. So what you want to do is you want to go to the admin section of your website and you want to click on add new and you're going to type in these words site background slider it will be the very first one you click install and you say yes I am sure I want to install this then you activate it now once it's activated in appearances you'll see that site background slider is going to be there in uh, under appearances there are several tabs here we'll get back to that in a moment so you have the plugin installed after you set up your WordPress site then uh, this is installed you need to know a couple things that uh, site background slider does not do tiling of images and tiling is what occurs when you have a particular background image that repeats itself so that you what you'll need really is a is to find a background that is full screen usually that's going to be about 1200 pixels wide by 8 to 900 pixels tall and what this particular widget does is it stretches to fit the screen so when you've installed it and you've set up the various backgrounds they're going to rotate changing from one background to another and in each background you can put your subliminal messages you're going to be putting them in the far right of the background and the far left of the background the reason why you're doing that is because the content of your website is going to be covering up the center that's what people are going to be paying conscious attention to subconsciously the sides they don't pay attention to. Now I've selected uh, some very nice background images and I'm going to be opening my software and it's my software of Photoscape 3.2 let's start with this particular background. Now with this background what you're going to need to do is, uh, what you can do is put text. The text has to be relatively simple. And I'm going to 
make it more obvious here. But text should read things like um, like like this there. And what you can do is you can tilt it. In fact, I sometimes even put them upside down because the subconscious mind can read upside down images. Consciously it takes a little effort. And I want to adjust the the translucent quality. I want to make it not quite so opaque so it's barely, barely visible. There you go. So we got like this. I'm going to put another one in there, which is Share this. And again, I'm going to turn it a little bit more, turn down the opacity, and turn it sideways, set it right there. In fact, I'll just repeat that. I can do that with this software. And again, and again, now the interesting thing about having your messages on the left-hand side is in the West we tend to read from left to right. So we're going to ignore first everything that is on the left. That will make it a lot easier to have the subliminal messages be caught subconsciously. And I save it. takes a few moments. There we go. Now I'm going to go to another image and I'm going to put in some other subliminal messages. Let's make them a little more obvious here. Uh, share this is probably a good one. Uh, there we go. And I'm going to put this right where it is probably most blue and take if you if you have vertical lines going up and down you can align your text with that and it tends to hide it a little bit easier so let's go with another one let's say something like this is cool that's going to be what your subconscious mind is saying as a as they read this, and I'm going to put it over here. In fact, I think I should turn the opacity down. And we'll put in another message. And the other message is, uh, I love this. here and duplicate it there and we save it all right done now we have the two background images and we need to upload them to our server you'll notice as a general rule what happens is there we go as a general rule what happens is Site Background Slider will store your background images in this folder, but there are usually other images in there, so I create another folder called BG for background, and I save it. And for now, just click the Resize Images and click the Random Shuffle. Have everything else unclicked. So saved. And I create that folder, BG, I open it and I'm going to now put these two new images in there. Now because these are also very big images they tend to take a little longer to upload but it will work just fine. So they are uploading. Now let's go to our website. Now the website I 
have access to today is called Article Brain. And uh, we'll refresh. This will work with also with any theme as well. So as it refreshes, here you have the messages appearing on the right hand and the left hand side. Barely visible, but you can see them right there. And it's going to change in a moment. Well, it changed, but not to the one that has the subliminal in it. So let's go to another part of that website. You know, the ground images there also still still adjust. There it is. And you see the background image has the subliminal there and the subliminals on the right hand side over here. Now the thing you need to know about this is you can adjust the timing here. I would keep it at 10 seconds or less and a three second fade as you do that. Some other things that I, well, let me let you know what I'm doing here with this setting is I'm showing you the very simplest and easiest way to make a subliminal background images flash across your WordPress site. Some of the variations of this is you can use the same image for the background, duplicate it with different messages in it. So the same image will be appearing. It will seem as though the uh, website background is the same, but various subliminal messages will change. Now the other thing that I like about this is that if you're creative and can make an animated gift, you can have animated GIFs as your background and have the words just flash momentarily and disappear. By the time the animated GIF cycles back and repeats again, what will happen is it will have switched to another background image, so it will take longer for anyone to, to notice it. One of the things I like about this particular widget of site background slider is and, and incorporating this with subliminals is it should marginally increase the stickiness of your website. In other words, how long people stay on the site. By changing the background alone without subliminals, you will make a certain amount of people want to wait a little longer to see what background it changes into. And the messages, if they perceive, if they are perceived, it will force a person to look longer and harder to find them in the background. So they're going to stay on your site a little longer. Okay, if you want to know more about the secrets of influence and persuasion, you can visit my website, which is Mind Control Publishing dot com. There it is. And you can click on any of the books, CDs, or downloadable programs there. Now if you have used this software and have made your own subliminal website or have tweaked it in a unique way, please let me know. You can reach me by means of the contact page on mindcontrolpublishing.com. Now don't forget to like this video and to share it with your Facebook friends. Thank you much.